Welcome to the fifth part of my interactive zoom animation, the series where you, the viewer, votes on what comes next. Let's start by enjoying the art journey so far. It started by picking one of 20 fractals, ignoring a few sidelines and went through several color changes. Last time's winning section was C7. But before we have a closer look, let's see what other areas intrigue my viewers. Second place was section C3. Only one person voting for this section specified a color, so here it is. But be warned, I recommend sunglasses. Ready? Here we go. Double logarithmic, double rainbow. A random gamer, this is for you. Third place is shared. Let's start with D2. The votes for color were incompatible, so I choose a liner rainbow palette. The other section that placed third was E2. Again incompatible color wishes, but both wanted to see a logarithmic distribution. So this time I start with the rainbow, and then the zoom in blue and red. The next couple sections only got a single vote, but I was having fun, so here are some extras. Next up is section A9. B7 with the linear rainbow palette. G3 and MPI color scheme. B6, double logarithmic classic colors. And the last for this batch, C5 in classic colors with linear and root 1.5 distribution. Now then, back to today's main topic. You have to pick our new target. I'll just start by panning around a bit. Now then, did you notice there is a kind of symmetry line running from the top left through the middle of the Ferengi vessel? with corresponding mini fractals on both sides. The difference being, that above is limos or tricorns, but below they are mini mandelbrots. Apart from various mini fractals on the left side, the right side is dominated by the double crescent resembling a spaceship from Star Trek. Maybe its rim and antenna house a secret we can uncover? Alright, now go to the comments and tell me where I should zoom in next, best specify a color scheme too. If you like this video then please share the link with friends and other people that might find it interesting. And if you haven't, consider to like and subscribe. I try to make a new video every couple of weeks. Thank you for watching, and until next time.